Mashhad, the ever-expanding city of history, religion, culture, and development. Being of a Persian progeny, Mahmoud the Abbasi Caliph tried to legitimize his caliphate by seeking Imam Riza's approval and allegiance. As he failed to do so, he decided to eliminate the eighth infallible Imam of Shiites. 1,321 years ago, concurrent with 818 AD, on this very day, he poisoned Imam Riza using a bunch of grapes. His holy grace was buried in a village called Sanabad, where his followers began to settle owing to their belief regarding its sanctity. That was how the city of Mashhad was born. The city of Mashhad is the capital of Khorasan Razavi province in the northeast of Iran. It is linked to Afghanistan in the east and Turkmenistan in the north. The place used to be called the Tus Plain hundreds of years ago. Mashhad is surrounded by Binalud and Hazar Masjid mountain ranges in Kashafrut Ribatui. Joint Iranian-French archaeological excavations in 1974 led to the discovery of 60 stone tools dating back to 800,000 years ago. These tools are claimed to have traced human settlements in the Southwest Asia. Inquire about the most spectacular view in the town and you will end up with the shrine and its magnificent gilded dome. This evokes a profound spiritual sensation in viewers. The nocturnal view almost lingers in memories forever, providing peace and even years afterwards as it conjures up. Behzad's comprehensive commentary during the tour in the museum gave me a fun ride to the depth of Mashhad history and culture, as if on a time machine. <laughs> مشهد و خراسان یه بیش از 20 هزار گونه مختلف گیاهی ما داریم که هر کدوم از اونها استفاده خاص خودش داشته. Busts of science and cultural figures of Mashhad can be seen in the front yard, namely Khaja Nasiruddin Tusi, the great astrologist whom every Mashhadi is proud of. He established Maraghe Observatory 800 years ago, a volcano with a 40 meter opening in the southern hemisphere of the moon is named after him. Yet, there is still heavy congestion downtown and in vicinity of the shrine. BRT has been a partial solution to the problem. Also, thanks to municipal development programs, the new inner city train system transports a large number of commuters conveniently and at a reasonable fare. The mayor of Mashhad was awarded the honorary diploma by the metropolis in 2012 for his quality performance in innovations in municipal management. Mashhad is situated on the oldest trade routes of the world, the Silk Road. In the old past, merchants traded commodities, namely silk from China to the Mediterranean and then to Europe. Nishabur, now a small town in proximity of Mashhad, was one of these stopovers. There are still caravanserais in Mashhad, which have been transformed to traditional restaurants. Baba Gudrat is one of them.
صف خان رستم را برای شما عزیزان نقلش میکنیم Narrator's favorite is Shahnameh by Abdul Qasim Ferdowsi. In the past, when there was neither TV nor cinema, these entertainers' performance seemed even more impressive than today's cinematic special effects. اینا خیلی چیز جالب سنگ اینا همه بله هنر سنگ تراشی و قلم زنی روی سنگ جز هنرهای سنتی مشهد آها یه مقدار راجع به تاریخ چش برام میگیم تاریخ که سنگ برمیگرده به سفر نامه امام رضا علیه السلام که در مفات جنان شقفاس قومی قید شده که امام رضا علیه السلام از نیشابور به طرف توس که حرکت میکردن به کوه های سناوات برمی کنن که یه عده سنگ تراش اونجا مشغول کار سنگ تراشی بودن <تصفيق> که دستور اطراق میدن و ظروفاتی که برای امام رضا علیه السلام میارن تو ظروفات سنگی بوده <تصفيق> که امام رضا علیه السلام همونجا تکه میدن به کوه و دعا میکنن Then I went to see a place where Shahnameh and his legendary heroes also play a key role. Zurkhane, the powerhouse. As you can see, the entry has been designed in a way that one needs to bend over to keep away from any egotism and of course pay your tribute to the spirit of the house. The powerhouse is more of a holy place to promote spiritualism and morality rather than a mere gym. This is a place where members practice constraint, humbleness, forgiveness, altruism and respect. accommodates the largest number of seminaries second to the religious city of Qom across the nation. The school I'm going to see today dates back to 360 years ago. The people who are in this school are the students who are in the school. In the diploma, the license, the license, and even the doctor. The doctor. خب به طب وقتی اینجور افراد وارد مدرسه میشن انتظارات هم از اینجور افراد فرق میکنه با اون افرادی که از مقطع ابتدایی در زمان قدیم وارد حوزه میشدن اون انتظاری که از اینها میره اینه که یک مقدار تخصصی تر و عرض میکنم کارشناسی تر وارد مسائل دینی بشن و دین رو خوب بفهمن حلاجی بکنن The city of Mishad is known as the spiritual capital of Iran It is also the largest job market second to the capital Tehran this is chiefly due to vast farmland in addition to more than 2,000 industrial units in the vicinity of the city. Therefore, it is undoubtedly regarded an industrial and agricultural pole as well. The hustle and bustle of the town as well as the crowd frequenting the bazaar and markets are daily scenes. I can show you what you can take from Mesher as a special souvenir. سلام سلام احوال شما چطور هستین شما خوبین خسا نباشین شما خوبین ممنونم زعفرون میخواستم مشهد سفران is ranked among the best in the world 170 of the entire 230 tons of the global production is harvested in Mishad it is the most expensive spice in the world Kursangi as one of the oldest recreational centers still evokes the most profound sensations of nostalgia for both visitors and citizens. As an adjunct to Kursangi Recreational Park, here is the place for children to be given some kind of entertainment. They can not only enjoy a variety of outdoor games, which they desperately need given the modern sedentary lifestyle, but also are given the education that what we call as civil education, the one that they need in the future life. Mashad's children are now prepared to build the future of their town, which in turn is based on a rich past. They are closely linked with the history, culture and faith to which human civilization owes a great deal. They are the heirs to the peace, knowledge, benevolence and fraternity passed down from their ancestors.
For these children, there are now eight anonymous role models buried on top of the peak of Kusengi, who symbolize self-denial and forgiveness, two of the most praiseworthy human merits. These eight anonymous martyrs in the vicinity of the eighth Imam are the eternal sources of pride and dignity for the children in this heavenly city.